A few months ago, I went to an absolutely insane Pokemon card shop in London. I was super impressed by the number of cards that they had, the variety of cards and how nice the staff were. Hey, my name is Hugo and in today's video, we're going to be going to Brotherhood Games in order to find out if it's the best Pokemon card shop in London and if you should go if you're in London or if you visit London. Brotherhood Games is located in St. James Road, which is quite close to Bermondsey Station in South East London. I'm about to go meet Daniela so we can explore the store and see if we can find some amazing Pokemon cards. You guys know I'm a sucker for alternate art, but I'm actually looking for some XY era cards now. Will they have them? Let's find out. All right, here she is. Are you ready to go back to the shop? I am. Let's go. It's actually on a corner, so you might have a hard time finding it. It's close to a Tesco. But yeah, if you guys just come around this corner, here it is. So we've got a bunch of cards here. They've even got like graded cards and stuff. The prices are actually quite good. Guessing these cards are all in mint condition. Or near mint. Look at this. Wow. A bunch of rainbows here. Some graded cards up there, look. Wow. Let's go. All the trainers. They've got everything here, man. They've also got a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. All the monster cards here. It's fully stopped. We've got a bunch of tins, booster boxes, sorry, <laughs> packs, hidden fates here, 18 pounds, three packs for 50 I think, we've got more cards here, sealed products, they've got Japanese stuff too. Pokemon Go, 25th anniversary. Fusion Arts. Blisters. Oh, look at that. All right, guys, so we've left now. I bought one card, but we got a bunch of packs and Daniela bought one card as well. They had some XY era stuff, but they weren't in great condition. Um, so I definitely need to go back and maybe get some more. We finally made it back guys. And as expected, we couldn't help but pick up some cards and some packs and stuff like that. I mean, they did have like a lot of cool cards, especially like XY era ones, but they were all in like lightly played or heavy played condition. And I'm looking for stuff that's more kind of near mint. But I am gonna go back um, to speak with their staff. So shout out to the staff members and they're gonna be able to sort something out in like near mint condition i think they sit down with their customers to see what kind of cards they want and then they either source them or they see what they can what they can do but here's the stuff that we bought so daniela actually ended up buying the most expensive card today for once i bought this for myself which is the giovanni's exile just to, i think it's from a hidden fades if i'm not wrong but it's just to add to that um, Team Rocket collection that I have in my binder. So I've got the Jesse and James card. I really wanted to pick this one up. And we also have this, this card here, the Megalopani and Jigglypuff. Daniela couldn't help but buy this. She had to buy this card, so here it is. It's actually good and it's in decent condition. So that's a win. And here we go. We have some sealed product as well to open. Some Chilling Rain, some Lost Origin and some Astral Radiance. The reason why we bought this triple blister is because Daniela really wanted this Eevee card. If you guys are ever in London and you want to pick up some Pokemon cards, then Brotherhood Games is my top place. They actually have all different kinds of cards from all different kinds of eras. They have like a glass display where you can actually see the cards. They have graded cards, Japanese product, English product, anything you can think of for a decent price as well. They don't 
overcharge or they don't charge like retail price they actually charge a reasonable price for their stuff plus the staff is super friendly so i'll definitely recommend that as my number one place as always make sure you drop a fat like and subscribe to my channel for more videos next week's video is going to be awesome so make sure you subscribe because you don't want to miss that see you guys in the next one peace